What does QBE's classic cover mean for me? Well, saving money on my home insurance is easy with great value features. So even before I claim, I know I've made the right choice. QBE's classic cover, for sure. Give them a call. Well, Shops, it's the first game where you'll uh, lead the team outright on to a grand final. Yeah, no, I mean, it's pretty exciting times, you know, from where we've come from earlier in the year. It's been a fair effort for the boys, but, you know, we're, we're not done yet. We're not just going to the grand final and make up numbers, you know. And, mate, um, tactics today, you know, what were the instructions that Muddy gave you? Well, obviously it was, a, you know, another big hit before the game with uh, Brody. Brody not playing, so we had to change a little bit of our setup. So when they had the, the breeze, I was going to play a little bit behind the ball. When we had it, I'd start back and move more into the ruck. But, uh, you know, chops had changed all day. And it just, with, with those sort of conditions, it just, you know, a lot of the tennis goes out. The uh, window and puff and just get the ball forward. And Big Wheels, you know, he did the job, didn't he? Ah, no, he's bloody good. Wheels, he's, he's had a great year. He's, uh, he's been awesome, the very best friends, has been real good. And Steve-O up there at Ford, mate, he was a sure haven't you? Oh, mate, that, uh, that staggering kick in third quarter is one of the ugliest kicks I've ever seen, but that matter when they all go through. But Steve-O well, was good again. Yeah, well, I thought uh, Kivo tried to replicate it in the last quarter. But... No, Kivo, the only one that kicked the worst one was uh, Steve-O, it was Kivo. <laughs> that's because Kivo is only three and a half foot, so sometimes the middle is bigger. <laughs> Easy on the short blokes, mate, come on. <laughs> Well, mate, it will be a big thrill this week, yep. and um, you'll just go about your business as you normally do? Yeah, exactly. I think we'll try and lean on a little bit of the experience of the seven or eight boys that have played in grand finals, and just, you know, keep the boys nice and relaxed and look forward to the opportunity. And I think that's what it's been every week, is it's just been an opportunity for our players. Yeah, oh, absolutely. And, you know, the, the amount of the young boys have grown into, you know, better and better players, and Curry's, you know, Abe Davies, and all of those, you know. What they've, uh, you know, that, that's really what's driven the improvement of the side. They've just been sensational this year. And, uh, mate, I can tell you, I wasn't all that happy with the lead-up to the game, with all this hype about how often we lose up here. I think from 2003 through to 2009, we lost here once. So in six years, we lost here once, and they're making a big deal of, of two years. Yeah, exactly. I still think it's um, people like to reflect on the late 90s. Um, you know, we, they certainly had our, we had our measure, but, I mean... You know, we're, we're here to create our own history, and I think, you know, since we sort of got over the glory years of what we did, you know, 10 or 12 weeks ago, we've moved on to some new group, and, you know, past is the past. All the best for next week. Cheers, Lenny. Thanks, mate.